This is Blazers All Access, an inside look at UAB Athletics. Presented by Pepsi, a Southern original, and by Viva Health, part of the UAB Health System. Here's the voice of the Blazers, David Crane. A six-week layoff wasn't too much for the green and gold as UAB will play for the Conference USA Championship this Friday after a 21-16 win over Rice in Houston. Welcome to Blazers All Access with head coach Bill Clark. I'm David Crane. Coach, you were short-handed last week. You weren't sure you were going to play last week. How proud of this team are you with the way they handled all of the challenges? Yeah, it's, it's hard to put into words just really how proud we are. And, I, and I, as I was telling you and I've told others, really to watch these guys, just their pure joy when that was over. I mean, they stayed upbeat. They were positive. They had great energy. They fought, fought through all that adversity. And then to get that win was, was huge. It was 42 days since you had last played. That's a lot of practices, not a lot of games. How long did it take in your mind to shake off that rust? Yeah, that's a good question. I think for sure the first series, you know, soon thereafter I saw we started playing like us. Second half, though, we came out the second half and looked like us. Had to be frustrating when Rice had a 12-minute drive in the first quarter. How hard to stay patient on the sidelines when you couldn't get off the field? Yeah, and I think that's one of the things, and I said this, you know, the other day, by holding them to a field goal, that was such an accomplishment. That long drive, we didn't drop our heads. Didn't drop our heads any the whole game. Had to survive a Hail Mary at the end. That has to be a unique situation for a head coach on the sidelines. Yeah, it's it's pretty awful. You know, you just <laughs> see the ball in the air, you know, and so, uh, but, you know, for, for Grayson Cash to make the interception and to finish it that way was really fitting. Green and Gold survived the trip to Houston and will now play for a conference championship. Here are some of the highlights from Rice Stadium. First and 10 at the 26, another throw to Myers in the right flat. Stacked up, driven back, and he's going to lose about a yard. 25, Johnston has the snap, play fake, drops to throw, wants to go deep. Down the middle, got a man, Shropshire in stride and tackled at the 20-yard line. A perfect throw from Tyler Johnston. Johnston gives to Lucius, running right, trying to get to the edge. He does, and he takes it in for the touchdown. Blazers able to wall off that right side. Play fake, Johnson to throw over the middle, and that one broken up around the 30-yard line. Johnson in the pistol has the snap. Play fake, wants to go deep, lofts it down the far numbers. Wide open Mitchell at the 25 to the 10 to the 5 touchdown UAB. That's a way to start a half right there. Play fake, Johnson to throw deep down the far side, and that one is caught, spinning into the end zone for the touchdown. Samario Rudolph makes the catch, spins around the defender, and takes it in for the score. Now man in motion, Johnson play fake, drops to throw. Pressure comes, he rolls right, tripped up, and sacked. Back around the 17-yard line, Chris Mole, kind of a delayed blitz there. Johnson the snap, straight drop, set up a screen to the near side. Catch made by Jake Bailey, and he'll take it across or take it to the 20-yard line. The highlights are brought to you by Viva Health. 25% cash back with Pepcoin? I like big bucks and I cannot lie. The kind of cash Pepcoin provides when I walk down the aisle with a hungry face and things that I want to taste, I get paid. Earn 25% cash back now at Pepcoin.com. You weren't thinking about a Medicare plan back then, but at Viva Medicare, it's been on our mind for a long time. And we know a thing or two about making Medicare easy. That's why our plans have $0 copays for primary care physician visits. So when the time comes to enroll in a Medicare Advantage plan that focuses on the things you're passionate about, we'll be here for you. Viva Medicare. Enjoy life without the worry. Learn more at vivahealth.com slash Medicare. Sometimes you don't find your comfort zone. You create a new one. Regions can help with advice and tools to help you budget, save, and plan your financial future so you can brave a new beginning. This segment of Blazers All Access is sponsored by Regions Bank. Two good defenses were on display Saturday in Houston. The green and gold totaled 354 yards on the afternoon while holding Rice to 254. 
Owls managed just 66 yards on the ground, 188 through the air. The Blazers ran it for 137 yards and threw for 217. Rice managed to control the ball for nearly 15 minutes longer than UAB. A little surprising when you see their third down numbers, but not when you see they were three out of four on fourth down. Coach, the disparity in the, in the total yardage really came down to two plays, both big completions for touchdowns, courtesy of Tyler Johnson. Yeah, you know, and I think, you know, when somebody really wants to pack the box in there, you've got to be able to hit them over the top. Great throws, great catches, big plays out of our passing game. Tyler, 9 of 18 passing for those 217 yards and two touchdowns, but he was also UAB's leading rusher in the game, 41 yards on seven carries, and most of those coming late trying to run out the clock. Yeah, and we kind of, that was something we've saved, you know, and, and now to get him back well, he's that nifty little runner, you know, and kept the, kept the clock rolling, kept, kept the ball away from them to the very end. On the other side, four Blazers led the way with seven tackles apiece, and you're able once again to be disruptive. Twelve tackles for a loss and five sacks. <clears throat> yeah, the defense played well, you know, and I think the big thing for us was as that game moved, we got better. Only one turnover in the game. It came on the final play. Grayson Cash made the interception. I was sitting behind him on the bus on the way to the airport. Someone asked him about knocking it down versus intercepting it. What's your preference there? Well, I think for us, the big thing, we knock it down if, you know, if there's any, you know, but if you in doubt, but I think that was one of those, he went up and just took it. So we're, we're happy with the result. Legacy is what you do every day. We try not only to help people with their financial legacies, we hope that we enrich their lives and help them become better people so that that total package, at the end of the day, is something they can be proud of. We help them craft their legacy. As we celebrate 100 years of women's suffrage, we reflect upon a time when we could not register to vote nor hold public office. But now, we have the privilege of representing the people of Alabama in the state legislature. We must continue to educate and empower women because together we can continue to shatter records and overcome barriers. Register to vote and obtain your photo ID so you too can exercise your right to vote on November 3rd. This segment of Blazers All Access is sponsored by Children's of Alabama. Seven different Blazers caught a pass on Saturday. Hayden Pittman and Jermaine Brown caught two for the nine total completions. Myron Mitchell had only one. It was a big one, 63-yard touchdown on the first offensive snap of the second half. But our player of the game is Samario Rudolph. His lone catch, a 42-yard touchdown later in that third quarter that made it 21-13, and it was spectacular, wasn't it? Yeah, Samaria, what a great story. You know, just a, a, a walk-on who has earned his way and really is just a, a great hands guy for us and, and a guy we've kind of known was going to have a breakout game when his time came. You mentioned a great story. You told us after the game you got to do something nice for him last week, too. We did. We got to put him on full scholarship. It was just such a great scene. And, you know, when you can take a walk-on who's found a way to be here, you know, just him getting to call his mom, tell him he got put on scholarship, really proud for him. He had a drop earlier in the game which I think was more surprising to you than the big catch he made later in the game. It really was from his scout team time. And, and you know, there's always going to be some drops, but this is a guy you really can look back and go, when does he ever drop the ball? So I guess he was due one, and uh, now let's hopefully he'll catch the rest of them. Sometimes you don't find your comfort zone. You create a new one. Regions can help with advice and tools to help you budget, save, and plan your financial future so you can brave a new beginning. 25% cash back with Pepcoin? I like big bucks and I cannot lie. The kind of cash Pepcoin provides. When I walk down the aisle with a hungry face and things that I want to taste, I get paid. Earn 25% cash back now at Pepcoin.com. Legacy is what you do every day. We try not only to help people with their financial legacies, we hope that we enrich their lives and help them become better people so that that total package, at the end of the day, is something they can be proud of. We help them craft their legacy. This segment of Blazers All Access is sponsored by Legacy Credit Union. So it's the Blazers and the Thundering Herd for the Conference USA title games Friday night in Huntington, UAB's third straight trip to the title game, a first in Conference USA. 
weather here today is overcast, cloudy, kind of raw, and I guess it's going to be a little bit different in Huntington than it was in Boca Raton the last time you played for a championship. How do you go about preparing for the cold? Well, I think one of that's how we practice. We practice outside. You know, we're sitting out here at our pavilion. It's open air, so we are used to that. It'll probably be a little colder, you know, maybe some snow. Um, before we get there, so we'll just have to see. But I think to be in the championship game, you've got to be ready to whatever the weather is and play through it. Figures to be a lower scoring game with two of the best defenses in the league squaring off. Marshall tops in scoring, rushing, and total defense. The herd number one nationally as well, allowing just 11.4 points per game. What makes Doc Holliday's defense so good? They're very talented first. They don't try and do too much. Physical, good tacklers. They're pretty good on offense as well. They're second in the conference in scoring, passing, and total offense. They got a redshirt freshman running the show. Grant Wells leads Conference USA with 16 touchdown passes. His last game forgettable, though. Five interceptions in that loss to Rice, but he has been awfully good, hasn't he? Yeah, this was a guy that everybody in the country wanted. He decided to stay home and go to Marshall. Big arm, can run. Player, you know, the conference running back of the year last year. Uh, they got receivers. I mean, they are very talented and a big offensive line. You mentioned that running back, Brendan Knox, a junior. He's averaging over 100 yards per game, nine touchdowns so far this season. Several good backs will once again be on display Friday night, won't they? Well, we get our backs uh, <laughs> back to the back to the fold, and so that's good. And proud of the guys that did the work for us Friday, but to get Spencer back and uh, those guys back is going to be a big deal. Marshall had the week off last week, which may or may not be a good thing for the herd. You pieced together a roster last week, and now your numbers should be better on Friday, correct? We, they should be. We're going to get, you know, probably 15-plus guys back. You know, we'll still have a few out, not the 20-something, though, that we had out. Congratulations on winning the West for a third straight time, and best of luck in Huntington. Thank you. Pre-game on the Blazers Sports Network starts at 5 o'clock. Kickoff from Edwards Stadium at 6 o'clock. CBS Sports Network will televise the 11th all-time meeting between UAB and Marshall. Thanks for being with us, everyone. Happy holidays, and we'll see you next time on Blazers All Access. Blazers All Access has been presented by Pepsi, a Southern original, and by Viva Health part of the UAB Health System. This has been a production of the Blazer Sports Network from Learfield IMG College.